The following video is brought to you by Yellow Jacket. Visit yellowjacket.com to find out why Yellow Jacket is the industry standard in refrigerant hoses, tools, manifolds, and vacuum pumps, and many other tools. For the best selection of HVAC tools, visit truetechtools.com and use discount code after dark at checkout for 8% off of your total order. True Tech Tools, quality tools, essential support. TrueTechTools.com. All right, guys, just a quick video here. Right now, we're working on a XL15i. This is the same motor in the video where I told y'all that the low voltage is DC voltage. The reason I'm making this video is because that is untrue. I don't know why the tech support guy told me that, but I started looking at it more closely. This unit and the XL19i have the same motor, the same part number. When they gave me the same part number, I asked the, the guy at the train store if that was the same motor that I've been getting for these 19i's. He said, yes, yeah, the same motor. So I started doing some investigating and on the 15 eyes, there's no board. There's no communicating board. So it is a 24 volt motor, AC. Not, it's not a DC volt motor for low voltage because that's low voltage, that's low voltage. That's the plug for the motor. It gets it off the contactor coil because there is no board. I don't know why the tech support guy told me that but these motors are just like the X13. They start on 24 volts and the 240 is always present because it gets its 240 here off the bottom of the contactor and here off the bottom of the contactor. So the 240 is always present and you can see the brown and black right there. And these two are your low voltage, the yellow and the blue. That comes off the contactor coil. So, 240 is always present, and the contactor energizes, or gets 24 volts from the air handler or furnace for a thermostat call. That's what turns the motor on. So, even if you have a 19i or 20i and they have that board, it's just like an X13 motor. 230 volts is always present, and the motor starts on 24 volts. I just thought I'd clarify that for the guys that watched that last video. Thank y'all for watching. We'll see y'all in the next one.